All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're gonna try something that I've never done in before, and I don't think I'm gonna be able to hit it. But right down here, uh, below the shop, we have a silhouette target at 200 yards. I'm gonna see if I can hit it with 1911. Now, I highly doubt that I'm gonna be able to hit it, but let's go ahead and see. Hopefully you all can see that target down there, or at least you'll be able to see the dirt kick up around it, maybe. 1911.45, 200 yards. Here we go. Holy shit. Okay. To the right. I think that one hit the plywood. That one was right underneath them. Let's do five more rounds. I think I got two of those on the plywood cutout, the plywood silhouette. Let's see. Let's do five more rounds. Guys, I don't know if y'all can see that at all. Let's do the last five rounds I got. Like I said, I didn't think I could hit this thing, but just for fun, I wanted to see where the 45 was. Looks like it's shooting. I think I've gotten a couple of them on the plywood here. Uh, looks like I'm shooting about a foot to the right on, on a lot of these, if y'all can even pick it up on the screen. I was right above it. There it is. Did y'all just hear that? There it is again. That one hit the plywood. I hit that eight inch steel target twice. Now granted that's out of 15 rounds. But that's not so terribly bad for a 45. Uh, we're just out here playing around with it. Anybody that has not seen it, check out the videos. Uh, this is my Taylor's and Company. Uh, 45 is the Taylor's Tactical 1911 A1. Uh, they're pretty neat little guns. I just wanted to get this out today and see if we could even hit anything at 200 yards, which I guess technically we hit it twice. Um, but guys, like always, y'all are awesome. Like and subscribe. Until next time, I'll see you later.